Once upon a time, in an office not so far away. Everybody to the boardroom, now! How rude. There's no time for stories. Boardroom, now! I don't even work here. Profits are down 0.002%. Whose fault is it? Was, Was it, it you, Gilson? Or, or you, Wilson? But surely it's not one person's Okay. I found the work of the uh, filament department particularly displeasing. This filament is offset by naught. Point not one millimetres. Chills me to the core, it really does. So it was you, I'm the... But it's not his fault that people aren't buying enough of our light bulbs. I hardly think an intern such as yourself could understand the intricacies of light bulb manufacture. And where is my coffee? Go! That's all you're good for. And get it together, man. You know, I'm watching you. Everybody back to work. No, um, I'll get it. I can't believe you got us mixed up again. We do look very similar. And I can't believe Matt's in hospital again. It's his third concussion this month. Oh, they should do head trauma loyalty cards. <laughs> Victor's moustache is looking really good this week. Did you hear? He rescued a kitten from a tree the other day. I do think it's strange that no one knows what happened to the kitten afterwards, so... I bet he took it to an animal shelter. Soon I will control all of this. I bring the city to his knees, and the age of darkness, it will begin. <laughs> you didn't see anything. my coffee. Wait, what are you doing here? Um, Were you touching my lamp? I, you, you weren't here and That's I That's besides just... the point. It's been nine minutes and 33 seconds since I sent you for my coffee. And I want my coffee. Where is it? Here. And, and about time too. Now get out. I have important things to do. Oh, oh, um, I thought I should just tell you that I saw... Get um, out! Hey. Get out! Okay! Hey, Holly, where's Holly? Hi, Claire! Oh. Uh, what's in the box? Radio chips. I wonder why Victor's ordered so many. I wonder why he's ordered them in the first place. I bet he's donating them to the poor. Uh, okay. Uh, do you know where I could find... Claire. Why is the boardroom not set up? I've got to go. You could be making a radio. So, uh, what are you doing tonight? Tonight I am doing ballet. Oh, no, wait, that's tomorrow night. Tonight I'm cage fighting. That oh, sounds fun. Wait, what? I'm cage fighting. What are you doing? You're all late! 
so we're out of it anyway. Profits are down 0.001%. What's wrong with you people? Did I not tell you to sort it out? I can't believe Uh, meeting adjourned. Get out! What are you still doing here? It's okay, you know. Everyone's scared of something. I'm scared of spiders. My mum's scared of buttons. Uh, Holly and Holly, well, they're scared of being apart. And, um, and, and what's his name? Y you know, the irrelevant one. I'm not scared, okay? A and I don't care what people are scared of. I, I, I just, I, I was just uh, looking for my pen. <laughs> well, um, I'll go make you some coffee. Don't carry that in here, please. You'll break something. Don't go into the cellar. Little boys that search in darkness will only find what wants to find them. Now you stay here. I'll get that for you when I come back, okay? was not the only one to notice Richard's fear. What's that, Mimsy? Yes! Yes, of course we shall soon take over the world with my brilliant, evil, and most importantly, evil plan! We shall soon plunge the horror Sheffield into darkness! <laughs> Hi, Victor! Mm -hmm. Yes, fine, good, not evil. Time to cut Richard's power. Hope he doesn't mind the dark. Hey Claire, a bit of a problem here. It, it, it's dark. It, it's really dark. The shadows are gonna come to me. Oh my god. Please save me, Claire. I'll be right there. yourself, Mimsy. The plan is almost complete. Soon, all Sheffield will be plunged into darkness. Richard will be destroyed and we shall disappear. My evil plan is near completion. Ah! Claire? Hold on, I'm coming. Just like 
Should be everything. What's this? Evil plan. Victor King of the Dark World. All these years, I've been secretly putting radio chips in every light bulb we make. Soon, every light bulb from here to Hillsborough will explode, and the entirety of Sheffield will be plunged into darkness. Um, well, we didn't know about that bit. Um... You'll never succeed! You're too late! The age of darkness is here. Why hasn't it worked? Well, it's a good thing we don't use our own light bulbs. Odin's beard! The entire city's blacked out! No, no, it, it can't be! How do I not see this coming? My, my reputation will be destroyed. My company will be in ruins. My life's work. Oh, but I can't. All the light bulbs have been destroyed, you'd have to replace every single one. There's nothing we can do. The whole city's in darkness. And we're responsible. We have to do something. I've just had a bright idea. How is this still working? As punishment for his crimes, Victor was forced to deliver candles to the 10,000 homes affected by his wrongdoings. Well done, Claire. Hero of the hour. Anyway, back to work. Profits are up 0.002%. Let's keep it that way. And also, well done. You're all doing great work. Congratulations. Claire was promoted to glass curvature expert, replacing Victor. Productivity and profits rose, and the company have been able to continue bringing light to those who need it. Victor is making good progress. He only has 752 candles left to deliver and a lot of time to think about his crimes. Thankfully, he will never be lonely because he has Holly by his side. Richard has reformed his ways, or at least he's trying, but he's still scared of the dark. 